Hey Libra, this is your girl Aqua Goddess coming to give you guys a quick general reading. I hope all of you are having a great day. Keep in mind that this reading will be for past, present, future and it may or may not resonate with you. If you need to book a personal reading with me or if you need anything from me, the information will be in the description box below. Please make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel. We are still doing our Zodiac contest for the Zodiac sign that views my channel the most. You guys will still be getting your bonus reads. So congratulations, you guys did read the, you guys did win the bonus read for yesterday. I'm going to go ahead and tap right into the energy. I've already meditated and prayed over your energy, Libra. Spirit, angels, ancestors, guys, give me clear messages. Protect me through these channel messages for the sign of Libra. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node. Return all negative energy back to sender tenfold. And anybody showing me love, much love and light to you. So, Spirit, what is it that I need to communicate with Libra? Somebody's spreading gossip about you. They could be calling people, talking about you. Maybe you have a lot going on right now. Um, this could be good or bad. People are just finding something to spread gossip about. Or this could be someone actually calling you to spread gossip about someone else. Yeah, somebody that you possibly are fighting with or not agreeing with at this time could be spreading rumors about you or making up lies or whatever the case may be. Or someone could be arguing in a connection because of rumors that are being spread or things that are being heard. Chaser. So somebody is chasing someone. Um, someone could be talking to their friends about how a feminine or a masculine energy is chasing them or whatever the case may be. They definitely could be in their ego at this time. <clears throat> this can be someone that you're not getting along with or whatever the case may be. Yeah, this is a player energy here. So someone could have received the phone call in regards to their person being unfaithful or this could be just a player energy that wants to be chased. This is someone who gives empty promises. So they could have, you know, made promises to meet up, go out to lunch, for drinks, whatever the case may be. They don't go. Th this is a man or a woman that's not about their word. Yeah, somebody is definitely pulling back their energy. I'm definitely seeing that someone sees somebody for their true colors. And it's not something that they want to tolerate. Yeah, this could be somebody that you're no longer sleeping with. Or because some people could be going through some type of celibacy. I'm just saying a lack of sex somewhere. So if this isn't you, this could be the individual you're dealing with. What else for Libra? Yeah. Somebody no longer wants to play the victim anymore. At this point, they want to chase somebody. And the only reason why they want to chase them is because they're uninterested. So this is someone that's non-committal, but they like to hold on to another person's energy, even though they don't want to provide a commitment. This is just someone that's wanting an ego booster or to have something to talk to their friends about, gossip about, whatever the case may be. So we're dealing with the energy that likes to feel important. Let's just put it that way. Could definitely be an earth sign. Um, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This could be someone you met at work. Yeah. So somebody is definitely not into players. They're more of the committal type. The other person is more of a play to field type. So somebody's definitely going against the grain of somebody's values and morals. And this not it's something that's not working at this time. That's the reason why this person feels uninterested. Yeah. Okay, what else do you So there's definitely some type of spiritual learning here. 
Um, definitely this individual who wants to play the field and give all these broken promises. They're definitely going to be going through a spiritual awakening here. They're going to be facing karma for all of the bullshit that they put out into the universe. Definitely, um, this is someone who comes off as an open book, right? Somebody that you can ask questions, have a conversation with, this, this, and the third. But then it's like a part of them is fake, like, because at the end of the day, they have side piece here. So this is either someone that's not willing to open up their heart to a commitment, <coughs> or they just like to have multiple options. They're not looking for love at this time. Some of you guys could definitely be thinking about planning a vacation or uh, moving to a new state, needing a new scenery. I'm also picking up the energy that somebody could have met a karmic or a side female or a side guy while they, were, while they were on vacation. And they were very open with this individual, very friendly. I definitely see some type of sexual chemistry here. So this could have been a situation where somebody went on vacation and they met somebody and had sex with them or kept in contact with them even when they left and went back home type of energy. Yeah, sneaky link. Yeah, so somebody definitely went on a vacation or a trip or somewhere that's not where they live and they met somebody. They got to know each other. They were talking. They were open books with each other. And it's like they made this sneaky link feel special or this sneaky link made them feel special. Put it however it resonates. Yeah, this is definitely somebody who is a ego chaser. They like to show off their money, but they don't like to spend it on people. This is a very cheap skate person, but they want the whole world to know that they have money this could be the type of person where if they have multiple phones they have to let everybody know they got more than one phone or more than one car or more you know what i'm saying like just a flexing ass energy basically here could be this earth sign virgo Taurus, capricorn yeah somebody definitely wants to break a cycle could be this player here wanting to break the cycle of being disloyal and actually build a solid connection. Somebody's definitely thinking about taking a risk or opening up a new door when it comes to some type of commitment. They're wanting to break the cycle of going through the same shit over and over again, confirmation. They want to make some positive changes now that the other person's not interested. This person wants to start to try to take accountability or, and make some steps moving forward. This person is definitely yearning for you. They're sexually frustrated at this time. They're thinking about you. They're missing you, missing the good times, looking at pictures, comparing you to everybody, cannot compare you to anybody, right? This person is extremely craving you right now. Like they are so frustrated and just stressed out over this whole situation. They're burnt out on not receiving sex. This is somebody who definitely has not had sex with you for a while or vice versa. They are extremely frustrated. They're thinking about if you're actually involved with someone else. They're ready to take a chance and take a leap on faith and try to be a more committal type of person. Yeah, they, they want to wisen up. This person wants to be more mature. Picking up a lot of earth energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Very grounded individual, self-made. This could be a very financially uh, stable individual here. They love you. See, that's the thing. Or just put yourself wherever you, whatever side of the story you are. But somebody is tired of being a fucking player. They love this person. They want to work on things. They haven't been able to find nobody else like you. This is like... 
getting the freedom that they so much desire and then not even knowing what to do with the freedom because it wasn't even worth it. It's like they lost something so valuable and now they're trying to focus on getting it back, trying to become more mature, more emotionally stable. Yeah, this person wants to walk through the door to see what's on the other side of this, this door here. Yeah, so this person definitely, definitely, there's somebody in this situation that's just tired of bullshit. And it's like, they're like really ready to walk out the door. This person's having a very much so wake up call. There's a spiritual awakening here. They see that they're losing somebody that's very valuable. Yeah, this person is out with their friends trying to have a good time. But at the end of the day, they're wanting to see you. Mm. What else? Yeah, so this person definitely, definitely is trying to move from a position from like not being ready for love to being open for love. This person is definitely coming out as an undercover freak. So they could be very, or this could be you. Whoever the person is that's not the player is a is an undercover freak. So they're very turned on sexually. This could be somebody, if you're a feminine energy and this is a masculine energy, this could be somebody that likes to squeeze your butt or... I'm just seeing a masculine energy here who likes to bite. Kind of in a sexy way, to be honest. Alright, so what else does Libra need to know? Alright, so you pulled your own energy here with the Tempest card. Um, also, Sag energy. So this is about harmony and balancing things out. Patience, right? So definitely somebody wants to cooperate because they they they're understanding that they need to grow up, mature, you know, be more mature and balance things out because they actually are in love with this person. This is just somebody that needs to grow up and get out their player way so that they can actually be with the person that they love. I'm definitely saying that you guys got boundaries when it comes to that shit. Some of you all could be Leo Libra cuss. Or you could be dealing with a Leo or a Taurus, Aries, or Pisces. But this person definitely has determination and to to fix something because they're definitely realizing at this point that you are different or wherever you or them, somebody's different and they don't want to lose this. They don't want to miss this opportunity. They definitely feel like without you that this is going to be a broken family or so maybe if you guys don't already have a family, this is someone that may want a family with you. They're wanting to manifest this connection back and make things right. There, I do see something going in your favor here, Libra, when it comes to a, a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus energy. I'm definitely seeing somebody want, wanting to reconcile or make things right or take you out for drinks or something of that sort. Some of you all could be in spiritual healing or somebody could be seeking a spiritual reading or something in regards to you. Yeah, somebody definitely is watching you. This is somebody who wants to have a lot of sex. I'm seeing 12 rounds here. So this is somebody who definitely wants to have a lot of sex. Somebody could have a boss that flirts with them or something. Somebody could have a smaller penis. Um, I... <laughs> Not trying to be funny or nothing, but I got, got got me bouncing on the pacifier. So somebody could feel like somebody has a small penis. They're not really satisfied. This person's very cocky. They're a show off when it comes to money. 
Definitely a side female in this equation. So third party energy here. You guys could be definitely communicating to telepathically with I often think about you and I know it's because you're thinking about me. So this person definitely telepathically communicates with you. Okay. Let's get one more for Libra. All right. Yeah. So this is going to require a lot of patience, <laughs> either mutually or somebody requires a lot of patience. You guys got the first chakra here, so make sure you look that up. Um, but this is just speaking about having patience for growth. Spirit is saying that right now is a time for reflection, persistence, and surrender as things are about to unfold at their own pace. Spirit is asking you to remain calm and tolerant during any challenging times and to develop quiet hope and expectations based on tr trust both in yourself and in a higher power. So trust the universe. Things are going to happen in divine timing. This person is definitely going to come back and try to mend some things. They are, they are in love. They cannot stop thinking about you. They're actually telepathically communicating with you. They're comparing everyone that they meet to you or vice versa here. Yeah, and it's like no one compares to the energy that you guys share. So this is somebody who is definitely moving from the player energy to a more mature role. And they're taking control over a situation so that they can develop something firm long term here. Yeah. Definitely somebody with a strong work ethic. Okay, I want one more card for Libra Spirit. Yeah. Spirit is saying, sit on your throne. Your potential is endless. So you guys are about to take over some shit. You don't have to leave your throne for shit. Especially if you're on the side of the situation where you feel like somebody's playing with your emotions. Don't come off your throne. This person's going to come to you. Okay. So Libra, that was your story. I hope you guys enjoyed this reading. Um, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel and I'll catch up with you guys later. Have a great day. Peace.